Morning everyone. Well this morning uh, we've just drafted out our uh, high cell count cows and low cell count cows for drying off. So these cows that we have in this paddock here, uh, they are a low cell count cow, so they've got cell counts below 100. And I'll take you to the other cows that we've got um, in another paddock, which are all above 100. So. The ones that are above 100 get uh, dry clocks and teat seal, whereas these cows here just get uh, teat seal. This year, our sow count's been a bit higher, and uh, we do have more cows that are getting dry cow this year. Last year we had 62 that we did dry cow on. This year we've got nearly 90 cows, so it's a few more. It's not a huge amount more, but uh, yeah, I don't know why. I think it's part to do with the drought because with the lower cows uh, producing less the sow count seems to creep up a little bit so I don't know if that is a reason or it's just uh, this season's been a higher um, sow count season. Uh, last year we did the same, we dried dried off um, 62 cows with dry cow and teat seal and the rest with uh, just teat seal so I don't know if it's an effect on that, that the cows that didn't get any dry cow, um, still have bugs, I'd have to have a look and see which cows uh, got dr um, dry cow last year and which one's got teat seal. So it's, a, it's quite a nice day, it's a bit windy, I was just over there trying to do the video and uh, it's too windy over there, I'm just uh, tucked back behind that knob there. So yeah, I'll take you down and show you the other lot and uh, then we'll carry on. So here we have the 90 cows. These, this, nine, uh, this mob of 90 cows are going to be getting the um, dry clocks and teat seal. So dry clocks is a four week antibiotic and teat seal is just a bung that goes in the end to prevent any bugs going up. Uh, so you've got to be pretty particular when it comes to drying off. Can't uh, push any bugs in with uh, the dry clocks or teat seal because uh, once you put the teat seal in, generally, generally once you put the teat seal in, uh, the bugs can't get out and uh, end up with mastitis. So you've got to bring them in and strip them out. So the uh, both mobs are pretty happy. They're only a small number in a fairly big paddock. So um, yeah. So tomorrow morning we dry off, drying off about three weeks early. Alright, better get back to it. Thanks for watching. See ya.